What's good everybody, it's your boy Raven C. So I'm very excited for the news that Dez Bryant is traveling to Baltimore, which is very, very exciting. It kinda took me off guard a little bit because on August the 13th, Dez put out, Dez Bryant put out a tweet saying, I literally just received great news and I'm thankful. So, after I saw that, I put a little gif of Lamar Jackson doing a little, you know. So, I was like, hey, could be some Raven news. Everybody else in the comments, I didn't see nobody talking about the Ravens. One person put the Chiefs. I'm like, really? But, and then Dad said a while back that he would play with the Ravens. At first, he, he wasn't interested. But then, when everybody see what that boy Lamar do, what that grown man do, changes their minds. They know he the truth. And good things are to come. So, and the good thing about this visit is, if you look over the Ravens' history and visits, a lot of the players, they, they when they... When they visit, they usually sign. So, I get two. I get, I, well, I wouldn't say two. I get a few things out of this. Is that, one, the Ravens obviously are interested. But they looking for that dog. As a wide receiver, they looking for that dog on the offense. Because they can't just have Ingram as the dog. They can't have just have... Um, Lamar at the dog. You need a dog to meet every position on the field. Um, wide receiver, we yet to see it. But we know Dez got that dog. We know Hollywood was injured. You know what I'm saying? First down, Willie Sneed, he's that laid back one, but he, he shows that passion though. You know what I'm saying? But you just ain't got that, just that dog to just go get him just to go get the ball. Dez, he had some drops back back in the day. And he got injured when he got signed with the Saints, so he didn't really get the ball out. And I believe if he didn't get injured, he probably would still be a Saint, or he'd probably be already off the market. But it shows that they really want that dog. They want that, they, they want that, that, that person to go snatch and go get that ball. So, it's the good and the bad. Good, Dez. Could be a Raven. The bad, for the people that want an AB, I'm one of them. Not gonna happen. And that shows that what AB did with the acting crazy. They still, they still kind of pondering that, I would say. They still pondering, they still going over it. So, y'all tell me what y'all think. I'm really excited about it, really. Dez Bryant in the number 88 for the for the Ravens. That would be nice. That would be nice. I want to see him get a second chance. The dude literally doesn't have no off-field problems. And it's, it's trippy because you see a lot of people have passion. They have passion for the game. And, you know, they show a little attitude a little bit. Um, but... They, the media make it seem like it's a negative attitude. What comes to my mind is, I remember seeing a couple of games when Dez was a cowboy, even though I hate him. I hate the Cowboys. But when he was on the side of the line and he was just like hyping his people up and you can you can hear the audio at first because the, the mic, the audio mic didn't come out and the announcers, the broadcaster, the commentators were just like, look at him on the sideline. He's yelling at all the players. He's doing all of that. And then when the mic audio came out, he was literally pumping his guys up. It looked, his body language was looking negative, but it actually was positive. And Dez is a positive dude. I stay in Dallas. Dez stay in Dallas. Dude, the dude does so much for the community. That goes under the radar, just like my boy Crabtree. You know, he had a short stint <laughs> with the Ravens. But 
he did a lot of things for the community. And I believe this Dez, if he do sign, I see it as a one year, maybe two. Um, Because, you know, if that first year don't pan out, they can just let him go like they did Crabtree. But I'm really excited to see what happens and the hype on this. Because I know if they do sign him, people are going to be right back on that bandwagon with the Ravens again. It's already full of bandwagon Ravens uh, since Lamar. But y'all tell me what you think. Stay safe. Wear your mask. God bless. See you next time.